Hi everybody, this is Riccardo Pogliato. I am a PhD candidate at Carnegie Mellon. Hi everyone, my name is Shreya Chipiti. I am a graduating senior from the University of Virginia. And today we talk about uh, Vugo's first uh, influences of human AI workflows on decision-making in clinical imaging. This is joint work with Matthew Langren from Stanford, Michael Fitzke and Mark Parkinson from Mars, Diane Wilson and Paul Fisher from Antic Imaging Services, uh, and Eric Horvitz, Corey Ingpen, and Vesmira Nushi from Microsoft Research. Um, so uh, we we run, a, we run a study with veterinary radiologists. The radiologists uh, are employed by MAS. Um, and uh, we asked the radiolo radiologists uh, to identify whether each of 33 pre-specified radiographic findings uh, are present in X-ray images. And for each, this, uh, each uh, fi radiographic finding, they, uh, there was an AI tool that estimated whether the finding was present. Um, we conducted a, a multifaceted analysis that looked at the alignment between AI inferences and uh, radiologist diagnosis, diagnostic performance of uh, diagnosis, uh, confidence in decision making, and time spent on decisions. We also uh, developed a platform for this uh, uh, experimental task, and the platform is now available open source. You can see it here in the image. On the left, there was the X-ray image the uh, radiologist could interact with. In the center, there were uh, the various radiographic findings listed. And for each finding, radiologist uh, could uh, um, decide whether it was they were present or not and whether they would like to seek a colleague's second opinion. And obviously, uh, we communicated to them the AI estimated likelihood and binary predictions of whether the finding was present. Here we studied, uh, we focused on workflow configurations uh, and we use a between subject design. So what are these workflows? Uh, they, what we call the two-step workflow. Um, here, first, uh, participants would observe the X-ray and pre-register the diagnosis. And then the AI output was revealed and they could revise the diagnosis. In the one-step workflow instead, the X-ray and the AI estimates were shown at the same time. Yeah, so going into our results, what, one of the main findings we had was that one-step workflow participants anchored more on the AI recommendations. They were more likely to agree with the recommendations provided than the AI compared to the two-step workflow participants. And so when we saw these findings for all findings, we wanted to understand whether the one-step workflow participants were anchoring on AI suggestions uniformly. And so we had the lead radiologist of our study go through the 33 findings that we presented to the participants and classify the findings as either critical or absolutely right to important for a radiologist to either rule in as present or rule out as absent or non-critical. And so when we um, separated our analyses into findings that were either marked as critical or non-critical, we saw that the majority of the anchoring effect on these one-step workflow participants was coming in during findings that were marked as non-critical. And so we saw that these one-step part workflow participants were achieving a better performance because they were working with an AI that was more accurate. But at the same time, the reason that they saw this better performance was mainly because they were anchoring on findings that were marked as non-critical to the pet, which has implications for showing that it's possible that the AI was helpful in reminding radiologists to include certain findings that they weren't spending a lot of cognitive or mental effort on ruling in or out during their decision-making. We also saw that radiologists in the one-step workflow were more likely to agree with each other and more likely to deem the AI help as more useful and um, less likely to mark it as working with it as frustrating, which has important implications when we try to merge per accurate performance with subjective opinions during human AI teams and deployment of AI tools. Thank you so much for listening. <laughs>